Hey guys, it's Chris Cook here. I'm Independent Sensi Consultant. That website is chriscook.sensi.us if you're interested in taking a look. Some great Christmas uh, presents on there and fall and winter decorations and scents. Um, we're going to start a Timu haul here. And this was mainly like, here's free for, for free, four free gifts for you. And I think with the first purchase, I haven't quite figured out everything. You have to buy something, but then the rest of the days you go back and just um, get a free item. So this was one of the free items and it's a little loafer style shoe with little gold band. Um, nice padding in there. They do get beat up a little bit with a dent here, um, but they seemed pretty good. They stayed on, they seemed pretty comfortable. So there's those and they're that velvety material, but they do look better than the brown do. So here's that. Um, I got some shoulder pads. If you watch any of the stylists on YouTube, um, a lot of them will suggest using a shoulder pad that attaches to your bra. And they give you little Velcro pieces. So you have to stick them on yourself and hope they stay on. Um, I might use that little stitch gun, something like that. These are a little bit thicker. Um, these were free. And... I think I got a thinner pair too. I don't see them right here. Uh, oh, This order, I just got a bunch of little stuff. And this one, I don't think, I didn't get just now, but I don't think I ever showed you. Just little foot pads um, to give arch support. And they actually have like a gel part in the heel. So hopefully those will work nicely if I need them. And I eyebrow trimmers, so they have a little comb, and then you just snip off the end of your eyebrow. I really don't have any arm hair that you can see, but that's basically how it would work. I don't know. Yeah, I have very light arm hair in length and color. I'm lucky about that, I guess. These are the Coco Stop. The little kit, they give you a screwdriver and we've got a replacement jean buttons. Wanted to have those on hand and I like the fact that they give you the screwdriver so you can kind of keep it with you if you need to. Girl. Hi, Kai. I'm going to mess up my chair. Um, zipper pulls. I told you about these before. I love them. I have really bad arthritis in this finger. And uh, those, those helped. And then jean extenders. I'm um, just trying a new type. I don't know. The other type really didn't work for me. So we'll see how those go. And I can just keep everything in this little bag. Um, I would show you one thing, but it is locked in my closet. <laughs> um, so here, I think they call this like a Parisian style sweater. So kind of the lady sweater, um, with a cute little knit. It is that like viscose. It's very soft. Let's see. <laughs> Looks like this is just attached. Yeah, it is with a pin, <laughs> but one of those pins that does slide out, if you can see there. I don't think I tried this on yet. So, I don't know, maybe a black t-shirt. Darn it. And then it's kind of backwards, the pin is. That's not too hard. All right. 
I'm not sure about this, um, honestly. It's cute. Is it itchy? Maybe slightly, but I haven't had a sweater on yet. Zhuzh up those sleeves. Huh. And it's supposed to be open like this. It's not like it's too small or anything. But do I want this style? You guys, I don't think I want to keep this. Hmm. No, I just feel not right in it. Just doesn't feel right. It's slight, even though it's soft, it's slightly itchy. Yeah, no. It's a no for that one. I already have a return started. Um, red sweater. This one is a little itchy, but. Let's see here. Now this is bright red, and I know it looks beautiful with the green. Slightly cropped, but you know, not too much. It's right at the top of my hips. I feel like I should have gotten this in a smaller size. We have balloon sleeves, which are cute, but because it's cropped, oh, uh, you know, you could, probably do that little tuck. I just have like joggers on right now. Probably do that anyway. Yeah, that might work. I think I ordered this in a medium. But I didn't know how it would be. I thought it might be kind of like the cashmere sweaters that I've been buying, the cashmere type that I've been buying from Timu is wrinkly. Red's not going to be a color I use very often, but it might be cute, you know, tied over my shoulders or something like that. Hmm. It's a, it's a cute fit. It's bright. That is a bright red. I don't know on this one. This was one of the free ones, but it was like worth $17, something like that. I wanted something red, but I don't know. <laughs> There's that one. It's got a lot of static electricity in it from like the first time I put it on. This one was one I bought and I am returning it. Um, we've got a little bit of a stitch here that's unraveling. This one's a little bit heavier. It's a little bit darker than I thought. I think the color was apricot. I feel like this is one that I would wear open. Some of them, some of the thinner ones, I would probably wear closed or maybe the top button buttoned. And they're cute buttons. They have a little bit of white on, white enamel and then some gold. It's a heavier one and it's like variegated. And then we have got the black trim. See that there? And remember, if you don't, if you feel like you look slouchy, just put those um, shoulder pads in. In fact, the demonstration, I think it's Eminem Styling or something like that, Melissa. Um, just sneak one under there. Let's see. Um, she always shows like with and without 
so you realize what she's talking about. this in right but yeah shoulder pad no shoulder pad and I think this sweater in particular is made for the shoulder pad so yeah I think this one's cute it's mid hip <laughs> and I am 5'7 so yeah it's cute that I've been looking at for a long time everyone long time so it's a thinner knit I wouldn't actually call it sweater I don't know if we can tell but it is you know dressier you call this because I had a, my Christmas sweater last year was this material so the belt feeds through here and then wraps around now this would definitely not be like a work sweater You're supposed to tie a bow. Let's see here. I know I have this other. Well, I probably have to have a cami under this one. And you can always use these little tag guns to um, keep them shut wherever you want. Might need one, you know, down in here, right in here. But again, I feel like, and this would not be like a, you know, tuck in. I feel like right around the middle, it's not flattering to, to me because that's my problem spot. It's cute, but I don't think it works for me, if that makes sense. Now the next two I know do, or next three technically. So we have this cute little brown cardigan. It's these cashmere lookalikes. They're very soft. And I have noticed um, looking in my closet, I do have different types. They're not all the same, but um, I had one cardigan and I did get a navy blue one as well and that's what's in my closet that I can't quite show you but it's a good blue it's a navy blue and this I'd probably wear um like a cami under and then probably but not always just keep it buttoned up um sometimes a button or two at the bottom open would be cute. You can see that. But yeah, or or like little tuck in, front tuck. I think that would be cute. And I do like these and I am keeping these. Yeah, I think these are good. I like the color. I've been wanting some brown. Do I, I have another red in my, in an order. I think I do. And this one's burgundy and it's a perfect color burgundy and it is a round neck which I do not have any of these in the round neck but I loved well I was hoping I would love the color because all the burgundies I have are just they what I'm calling cashmere lookalikes are um 
The other one that was burgundy is more of like a berry color, which is fine. I like the color. I have a pink one, but that, that one's closer to this, but more berry. So I think you can, you can kind of fake a V like that. You can, you know, wear it open, of course. Let's see, I might not bother, but open, open at the bottom, little tuck. I like the color. Um, I think this would be cute. And maybe, you know, maybe this is as close to red as I get. Burgundy. I like to have the red and the green for, you know, holidays and stuff. Winter holidays. But red's not really my favorite color. I actually like kind of how that looks, like the deep V with something under it. And, oh, we have one more thing, guys. Something I'm not happy with at all, but I should have known. <laughs> all right, so. already in the bag to return. You know, I got the song mountain first in, um, camel and it, um, I used it and it was just so hard to get in and out of. And then I thought, well, and then I got the green and those were real. You guys, they were both real. This is not real. This is a mess. It does have the lock somewhere hanging on. It's got the same hardware. It really does. And design, but this is, I can tell the difference. The song months are um, like natural leather that are gonna get um, its own patina. It doesn't have a gloss and this color is ugly. The song Mont green one was nice. Unfortunately, I did return them both, and then I thought, oh, this is only 20 some dollars. Mm. This is bad. But I, I would assume, ooh, I don't think you can even, yeah, you can't even get it into that position without really, really ruining it. Yeah. This is a definite no, 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 no. Um. Yeah, I think that's it. I would thank you for, excuse that noise. I would thank you for joining me. I really appreciate it. And all of you have subscribed, but I just wanted to kind of show you what um, has come in today. And, oh, one more. I'm not, obviously not gonna be able to try these on. Hopefully they do work, but I guess I should try them on to myself. black jeans. I haven't even opened them yet. It was easy to put the tops on. They have a raw hem at the bottom. A little bit of fray. A high waist with two buttons. And they, oh, they're hard. They're kind of rough, but they are very stretchy. Um, I sized up in these two. So, I've got something stuck to them, that's good. All right, they are wide leg. I wonder if they're gonna be too big on me. <sighs> Jeans. <laughs> um, I sized up, but I feel like they're gonna be too big, we'll see. Thank you again for joining me and for subscribing and liking my videos and leaving me comments and all that. I love talking to you guys when you leave the comments. So thanks again for joining me. Um, it's really dark and stormy out there. So, and I guess we're going to have some snow tonight. So, or in the morning. So we'll see about that. Yay. No, <laughs> we will see you soon. Bye-bye.